What's up guys? Welcome back to the Redneck TV channel. And today, I want to show you all the bull crap, just everything I've put in my truck since the last time I had a truck update. So, yeah. Alright guys, before I get into anything, I have to give a shout out. Believe it or not, Redneck TV himself is actually giving a shout out. Holy shit, Redneck TV don't do it. Yeah, I'm giving a shout out right now. Now if you don't go to this person I'm about to say's channel and subscribe, you're stupid, okay? You're, you're dumb. Because I'm giving a big shout out to Jesse Ryan USA. This guy, he is so intelligent with all this politician shit. Just, he's the most American person I've ever talked to, ever. He's, he's awesome, y'all. He's a really good buddy of mine. Just overall, 10 out of 10 guy. So make sure you go subscribe to his channel because he's at 25,000 subscribers right now. And when he hits 30,000, he will be doing a mud jug giveaway. He'll be giving away 30 mud jugs for 30,000 subscribers. Can you believe it? So if you want a chance to win one of those 30 mud jugs and go over to Jesse Ryan USA's channel and go hit the subscribe button. That's all you gotta do. And stay tuned to his videos. On his 30K video, he'll announce how he's gonna do the giveaway. So if you wanna win a 30, 30, win a mud jug out of 30, go subscribe to his channel. If you don't do it, you know what you are, man. Stupid! Okay. And also, I want to say that tomorrow, it's going to be my birthday. I'm going to be 17 years old tomorrow. Tomorrow is going to be March 1st. I'm going to try to record, edit, and upload this video today. So I'm, I've am i been stressed out all day thinking about making this video because it takes me a long time to make videos because as you know, I edit the hell out of my videos. So if this video is poorly edited, I'm very sorry. I'm, I'm going to edit this in a rush because tomorrow is my birthday and... I want to drive around because I just got my license yesterday or my intermediate. I passed my test. Almost a perfect score except for that parallel parking bull crap. I didn't take it in Hazy, so I took it in my mom's car and yeah, I can't. That, that car, I hate it. But anyways, I got my license, so I love that. And, you know, I can drive by myself, drive to school, you know, pick up my girl, you know, take her home and all that bull crap. But tomorrow is my birthday and tomorrow, March the 1st at 9 o'clock, I am going to be doing a live stream. Now the application I'm gonna be live streaming on, it's really easy to access. All you gotta do is to go to your phone's Play Store, whatever kind of phone you got, App Store, Google Play, anything, Marketplace, whatever the hell kind of phone you got, and go download this app, and it's called Live.me. Then what you wanna do, once you download Live.me, make you an account, and then you go to that search button on the users, and you type in Redneck TV, just like my YouTube channel name is, and hit the follow button. I think I have like 12K on there. You know, all the other fake redneck TV wannabes, they won't have 12K followers, so it's pretty obvious which one is me. So go follow it, and at 9 o'clock, I will be doing a live stream, and I will announce when I'm starting live stream on my Snapchat as well, so go follow me on Snapchat, Kenny G-A-G. -G. It's at the end of every video. So make sure you're there, because it's going to be really hype. It's going to be my birthday stream, so, you know, if you want to make give me a birthday present, you know, uh... There's these little things you can send gifts, and the gifts give me diamonds, and the diamonds give me money. And when people send gifts, I do these crazy challenges like uh, this guy, he sent a bunch of castles, dog with cookies, and I drank, dip, spit, ate three cans of cowboy coffee chew. I, I did some insane crap. So if you want to join in on the fun, you know, have a good time, laugh at your phone for maybe an hour or two, and go watch my live stream March the 1st, 9 o'clock. I'm, I'm going to try to get it at 9 o'clock. If I don't, then... I'm sorry. Also, hey Redneck TV, when's the new video? Did you quit YouTube? Where are you? I've been gone for six days. Oh my goodness, like everybody just stressing me the hell out. When's the new video? Well, I'm sorry. I've been really busy. I just got my license, been doing shit to my truck, been hanging out with my friends and stuff, and I, I got a new girl. I thought you said girlfriends were stupid. Wow, what a hypocrite. Shut up. Yes, I did say that in one of my past videos. I said, Girlfriends are stupid. Why commit yourself to one girl when you can have hella hoes? You know, I said that, but you know, that was just my personality, you know, being, you know, macho man personality I got, and you know, I got that, you know, I'm, I'm like that kind of. And I said that, but in reality, you know, it's okay to have a girlfriend. Just, it's just the point where 
you have a girlfriend and the only person you talk to is her, you don't hang out with your friends anymore, you just cut off your social life completely and just only, oh, it's all about her. Spend all your money on her and everything else and that shit's stupid, y'all. But the, in the hallways at school, sucking on each other's faces and shit, don't do that shit. Don't be that person, please. Just those kind of relationships, I don't agree with them. That, that's pretty much what I was talking about those kinds, but you know, you got you a girlfriend, you know, take her around, drive her around, shit, you know, it's just, it's just a friend that's a girl, you know, it's no biggie, damn, can I not be happy, as soon as I posted on my Snapchat story that I had a girl, you were, all y'all were like, hypocrite, wow, I thought you said girlfriends are stupid, just be happy for me, y'all, just say, wow, you know, good for you, Redneck TV, yeah, Kenny, whatever the, hell you want to call me? Be happy for me. Don't be an asshole. Thank you. And also, before I get into my truck, I'm sorry y'all. Y'all are dying to see what I've done to, to, to my baby girl, Hazy. Just, just, yeah, Hazy's number one. Just, oh yeah, love you, baby. Next video, I'll be doing a question and answer Q&A. And if you want me to answer your question, then comment down below in the comment section a question. It can be about anything you want. Funny, not serious, serious question. It can be about my girlfriend. Good. Just don't make all the questions about dip, you know. That's really what my fan, all my audience is just a bunch of younger, younger kids and they're all, dip is the best thing in the world, you know. Just don't ask all the questions about dip, please. Some normal questions, you know, and they have to be a comment question. I will not answer a question off Snapchat or anything, so if you want me to answer your question, comment. All you gotta do is scroll all the way down and tap to comment. It's common sense. <laughs> Dang, it's hot in here. I need some air in here, y'all. Give me a second. Woo! This is a good workout. <sighs> okay. But what I've done to Hazy, I've put, since the last truck update, there's been $750 put into her. That's a lot of money, once you think about it. $750. I can buy a lot of things, once you think about it, but I, I think I kind of spent it wisely. I could have went a little cheaper on the audio system I got, but, you know, I didn't. I, I should have went more expensive on lights. I really wish I would have. What I got is I got a Kenwood radio. I got a kicker amp and two dual 12 kicker uh, comps, sub woofers. And what I got in the front, uh, the headlights, I got a halogen halo LED upgrade. And then on the taillights, I got dark smoke taillights. They look really nice. Give my truck a really aggressive look. I'm going to show you all this stuff in a minute, but I'm going to talk about the subs a little bit. I hooked the subs up yesterday. I went to my buddy Caden's house. He knows everything about subs. He's a sub freak, you know, Know knows how to hook them up. I don't know crap about all that stuff. You know, I'm not really a wiring guy when it comes to a bunch of complicated bull crap. I'm more of a, you know, grab a wrench and fix an engine kind of guy. So I had him help me, or he pretty much did it. And uh, he put the radio in, he put the amp in and everything else, but... I was supposed to get a, a thousand watt amp, but they sent a 600 watt amp, like what the crap. These are dual 12s, each amp is 600 watts peak, so that needs a 1200 watt amp, so I'm probably just gonna get a 1500 watt amp, you know, might as well. The subs are only working half as good as they can, and I don't have an amp turned all the way up, so it could work a lot better, but they bump. They make my mirrors vibrate a little bit, you know, and they shake my seats a little bit, but once I get that new amp, windshield fly out of this dang thing but my girl she ain't done just yet i'm gonna put a few things i'm gonna get wheels and i'm gonna get a brush guard and a few other things here and there but i'm not just gonna buy it all at once y'all i've been thinking a lot and i just came to the conclusion that it is way smarter to just save all my money i make pretty good decent money but i i got bills to pay and stuff i gotta pay my phones i gotta buy my phones phone bill and uh wi-fi cable and dip gas and insurance stuff like that and this dang truck it's a gas hog especially me because i like to raise rpms up every single takeoff i'm gonna probably stop doing that you know but you know it it, it sucks up gas it's got big tires it's gonna suck up gas she's thirsty she, she needs some juice to get them wheels spinning y'all plus that 87 bull crap i don't get that i get 89 octane the the second most expensive one because you know, I don't want to put that nasty crap in my truck. I feel like the 89 is better for it, so that's what I use. I'm really picky when it comes to gas because gas is just the main thing that just keeps the engine going or one of the most main things. And you need to, you don't want to put a bunch of poop in your tank. Poop. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I'm just going to save my money for now. I don't want to spend more than half of what I make each month 
I'm gonna like slim down on what I buy. I'm not just gonna go off buy a $300 brush guard because you know I I got some money in the bank right now. I want to add it up over and over. You know, kind of get a big amount in my bank. I'm probably gonna save till the end of the summer, and then I'll buy wheels, and then I might buy the brush guard then, or I might buy it sooner. I'm not sure. I'm also gonna get a cold air intake, a new Flowmaster system, Super Tens. But that stuff, it's going to be in the future. So this truck, it's not going to be done very soon. Uh, I thought I was just going to just blow all my money, but I thought about it. And, you know, that, that's dumb. So yeah, I'm going to save my money. So why don't I just quit talking and I'll show you the crap. First thing I'm going to show you all is the subs. I'm going to show you them right here. And then I'll do an overview, show you all the bull crap I got set up, but I'm just gonna let y'all listen to them right now. My radio isn't Bluetooth, I thought it was, but I bought the wrong radio or something, but this is a really nice radio, it's Kimwood. It costs 150 bucks. I'm gonna tell you how much all this stuff costs, but I'll just tell you right now. Subs and the sub box and everything, and the amp and all the wires and stuff, that costs 370. The radio cost uh, 150. 50 and then the door speakers they cost 60 and then the headlights and taillights cost 150 so that's 600 bucks about that's 700 something dollars 600 for audio and then 150 for headlights and taillights let's pick a song out here play some rat music like my dad calls it that's what my dad calls this rat music he says rat i don't know why he's funny let's listen to a millie let's see how millie's doing how much money does millie have exactly <laughs> It's pretty loud. And the crazy thing about it is that's only half of what it can put out, or not even half, because that's a 600 watt amp and it's not even turned up all the way. So I give me a bigger amp, turn it up all the way. Boom! My truck's gonna explode. All my windows are gonna shatter. These subs are nice. And plus they're undetectable. I got them. I'm gonna show you all my subs real quick. Alrighty. I put my subs right under here. This is a 12, dual 12 box. It's real skinny and it sits under here. And the subs are under here. They hit under there. There's a little gap. You can see that. They sound really nice the way they got them set up. They just go slide right under the back seat and they got these spacers. And then, you know, people can sit in the back seat and they don't take up room. This is the amp I got. This is a kicker 600 watt amp. Um, not much to it. Just little knobs back here. You can adjust it and shit. This is the radio I got. This is a Kenwood radio. It changes uh, colors. It's a USB auxiliary cord. All that bull crap, you know, it, it's a really nice radio. I, I really like it. Alrighty, I'm gonna show y'all my halos. These are the lights I got. They work off the parking lights. You just turn them on, and then these are the halos turn on. These are the LEDs. The thing I got here is these two right here, they flicker on and off like that. See, they'll be dim sometimes, and then you gotta hit them, and then they'll. I don't know what's the problem there. It's just a little short. I gotta fix that. That's what she looks like right there, boys. These are the tail lights. They're smoked out tail lights. They look really good. I like the way they look. For some reason, my reverse lights don't work. I'm not sure why. Like, they work sometimes and sometimes they don't. I have no idea why. I guess I'll try to fix that, but it's not really a big deal. That's what the tail lights look like right there. All right, y'all. I'm gonna let y'all hear the subs one more time, and I got y'all in the back seat so it'll be louder for y'all. Maybe you can hear them a little bit better. I'm not sure if you could hear them with the microphone because microphones can never pick up the sound of subs, but just know they sound really nice. Like, they, they hit perfectly. Let's play a song. Let's see what we got. Oh, life could be a dream If I could take you up in paradise, I suppose. If you would tell me I'm the only one that you love. All right, y'all. That's my truck. Um, got the new subs. Got the new lights. Uh, I'll throw a picture up right here. What the lights look like. Maybe they look good on the picture. I don't know. But I'm sorry if this video wasn't very enjoyable. It was mostly me just ranting on about bull crap, talking and stuff. But, you know, I, I like to record every once in a while. I like to talk to y'all, sit down, you know, just have a conversation with my camera. But if you like this truck, you like me, you like my content, then make sure you go hit the subscribe button. 
you know, get constant notifications when I upload a video. If you tap the notification bell right beside the subscribe button, tap it. Damn it. Yeah. Also, if you like this video, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. G give me a thumbs up for my, my, my baby girl. Give me a thumbs up for my truck. If if you like my truck, you know, let's try to hit 700 likes for, for my girl. For 700. Can we hit it? Damn. And also, don't forget about the live stream. 9 o'clock, March the 1st, tomorrow. Tell your buddies. Tell your grandma. Tell your uncle. Tell everybody. Tell your little sister. I don't care. It's my birthday tomorrow. Live stream. Help me out. Send me gifts. Come on. You know? And I'm going to be funny. It's going to be a hype stream. And also, don't forget about the shout out I gave to Jesse Ryan. If you want a chance to win a mud jug, he's going to be giving away 30 of them for 30,000 subs. So go subscribe to Jesse Ryan USA. And I've almost forgot. Promo code for mudjug.com is RNTV15, 15 15% off www.mudjug.com and kaagear.com. You know, they got badass apparel over there. American apparel. Jesse Ryan USA's company right there. Go support them. And remember, always keep on dipping and keep on spitting. See you later, alligator. Booyah. Oh, life could be a dream if I could take you up in paradise.